Okay, we're going to have a look today at how to apply call out head families in our project. So if I expand out families in my project browser, annotation symbols, you can see I have two different call out head types loaded into my project. We're not going to have a look at creating these, how we apply them. So with the call out head that's a round one and this one here is an oval shaped one. So the first thing we'll have a look at uh, placing them into a floor plan. So if I go to actually, I'll just back up a little bit. We need to go to our manage tab first and create a new call out tag. So they're the call out head families. We need to create a tag that uses those families. So you can see this tag type here uh, is using the original call out head Oz. If I go duplex duplicate and I'll call it call out oval and we'll just choose that call out head there right so now that we're in our floor plan view if we go to place a call out we've got the oval uh, sorry the round head and if I go to create, uh, place another call out, I just want to bring to your attention the fact that we have uh, the detail view and the floor plan view uh, as we are in a floor plan view. Okay, so if I wanted to try and use the oval head uh, in the floor plan with the floor plan view option, if I go edit type, you'll notice the duplicate button is not available here. So I can only have one type for floor plan that's going to use the 3 mil call out tag. If I was to change this to the oval one, uh, you can see that it, it would actually update what's already there. Alright, so what we'll do is we'll just uh, reset that back to using the original one. And they both update. So what we can do is we can go for a detail view instead. Right, and uh, if we go to the edit type and change it to our, our detail view here, you can see I can create uh, another one here. And I can set the callout tag to be the oval callout. So now when I place my call out, we have an oval tag or an oval head. And if we choose this one here, it will give us the round head. Okay, so when we go to a section, sections are a little bit different. So in the sectional view, I can go to call out. Uh, of course, if I go and have a look here, I've still got the two different detail types that we created whilst in the floor plan. Have we noticed we've actually got multiple section types? So if I go to a building section uh, and we hit the edit type, you'll notice that we do have a duplicate button there. Okay, so if I can change the call out tag for each of these sections. So maybe the building section, we want to have the oval tag. Okay, so for building section, we've got oval tag. And for wall section, we've got the original round tag. So using the uh, building section, we get the oval tag. And if I go to wall section, we get the round tag. Uh, 